everybody it's pete the uh, monkey thrifter here um it's sunday the 22nd of august now the unit that i'm in there's a lot of building work going upstairs so during the week you can't hear the thing it's uh, it's pretty bad actually anyway i went to got um a facebook marketplace pickup uh, yesterday uh which uh, saturday and it's a guy that i've picked some stuff up before if you've seen my previous videos the one where i picked up a load of stuff um, had a lot of out of date ink cartridges that sold in no time. It was the same guy there. So let's just have a look and see what I've got. Right, so here we have the first one in two parts is this. So the first part we've got this um, uh, Samsung uh, Galaxy uh, foam, it's smashed screen. Um, I hope it'll get around about sort of maybe five, six pounds for that. And then the next is that is a Nokia uh, Windows phone, but. Um, there's no battery in it, so I'm looking maybe about a tenner on that. And I think it's struggling with the, the lights in here. Um, then we've got a selection of small watches, some just basic watches. Um, I've got a friend that said, well, can you get into the back and put batteries in? Test them anyway. Not much value. That is a, a Seconda, but it's only small for a little girl's watch or something like that. Uh, so I think so not much value in that at all. Uh, but, you know, I forget. I don't know, bundle there, maybe... 10 15 for them i don't know give it a try uh next one this really surprised me it's a bush it's a bush five megapixel uh, camcorder now the battery compartment the batteries have leaked and it's a bit corroded so i'm going to have to get get them all cleaned up so let's see if we get the focus there we are um there's a couple of um two gig memory cards in there uh i'll have to test them see if they're working but um, they can go for about a couple of them, ten, fifteen pound, I do believe when looking. Um, there's a smartwatch here. There's no charger with it, so I use Google Lens to find out what it sort of is. I managed to find one on eBay for around about three, four pound it was for a charger. See what that works. If it does, hopefully maybe get ten, fifteen on that. There's an old phone here, nothing special. Probably might either bin it or if I get a collection of other phones in bundles, put them together, send them out. I've done that before. This is a surprise. Sony Walkman Media Player. It works. Tried it out. It does work. Um, again, there's no charger with it. So I think charger are up to £3. So I might just get one, because um, that, it'll go for about 30 quid. We've then got um, some DVDs. This is Sean Meadows. Um, that's goes around about £10 plus postage. Band of Brothers box set. Not much value at all, so that might just go to Cherry Shop. Or I don't know if I've watched it or what, I don't think I have. Uh, this Peter K, brand new and sealed. But not much value. I do have some other Peter K stuff, and um, what I'll do is I'll bundle them together and uh, see what I can get for them. Right, so that's the first part of the haul. Right, okay, so the uh, second part of the haul is uh, mainly uh, video games. So we've got on the PS2 Jacks 2, which is coming in about seven quid. Um, most of these I've got uh, manuals, and some of them have still got the um, the prices. Look at this one, was this uh, purchased in Halifax on the uh, 13th of December 2003 for um, 29 97 Well, I'm just going for seven now. Um, so that's uh, that. Um, then we've got Manhunt, um, about a tenner on that. We've got disc only. GTA San Andreas, uh, about four quid on that. Um, Mafia is about six quid. Omniwisher is about going round round about what are we now? Um, uh, that's about eight quid. And then we've got um, for the PS One Rayman that doesn't have the manual with it, but still hoping to get round about ten quid for that. And then the next three we're bundled together because it's Medal of Honor. Uh, Rising Sun, and then we've got Light Out, uh, Metal Bonner, Frontline, 
and European Assault. So I'll bundle them three together and I'll be probably going about 10 quid plus postage on that. We've then got Dead or Alive 2 and that's on the PS2 and that will be also round about the uh, 8 quid mark. Uh, Dynasty Warriors 2 and we've got about 6 quid on that. That is Gauntlet uh, Dark Legend Legendary 8 quid. Gotta be careful how I say this next one. Big Mother Truckers 2 and that will be about 8 quid on that. On the PSP Pursuit Force, only about five or six quid on that. Um, on the Xbox, uh, Great Escape, and I've got on that uh, six quid on that. The thing on the Xbox, that's seven quid on that. Call of Duty on the PC MW3, and that comes in around about six quid. And then to finish off, there's a load of other uh, filler. Just fill the games for or this is like that's just a DVD actually, um, and no value in it as well. There's three, three Star Wars films for Lego. It's about two quid, including postage. Uh, and then these are just about the filler games. Oh, I'll bundle them with other stuff I've got. So we've got quickly, um, 2006 uh, Xbox 360, SpongeBob PC, PS2 State of Ind State of Emergency. Uh, World War Zero, PS2, these are very low price, Brothers in Arms, but I see Brothers in Arms, I might bundle that with Call of Duty and something like that, so you get a lock of war thing. Uh, True Crimes, uh, Red Faction, again these are only about maybe a couple of quid, something like that. Xbox Splinter Cell, can't find this anywhere, when I type in Xbox Crash, it's coming up with Crash Bandicoot. Um, the Hulk... Uh, Grand Theft Auto, well it's not, it's just a load of cheats um, Hitman 2, I've just sold Hitman 1 and 2 for about 5 and, a, another, and then the Grand Theft Auto 3 Which I've got some other Grand Theft Auto So I'll bundle that's great Because it's got the manual and the map inside So let's just go back and I'll tell you how much all that will cost Right, so that bundle that I'll just show you there um, That cost me amazing, unbelievable £25 so that Walkman on its own, 30, so that's paid for it, and he didn't profit all straight away. Um, and I'm hoping to get, um, looking at the list there, around about 200, uh, maybe a bit more with some of the um, ones that I'm bundling together and things like this. So as I said, I, I haven't done for for a while, I just thought I'd better bob in and keep me uh, keep this mush, this ugly mush um, entertaining you. Yeah? Uh, don't forget all the likes and everything else. And if you've got any comments, just leave them below and uh, let me know. And um, I'll, I usually respond to everybody because I get about three or four comments, if that. <laughs> right, okay, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks very much. Bye.